The 2016 European LCS Spring Split started with a few clear favorites heading into the regular season. Absent from everybody's top tier list, however, was the fresh out of challenger G2 Esports. Nine weeks later though, this team cemented their spot as the best in Europe, with a record of 15 wins and three losses. For a team that only qualified for the LCS on their fourth attempt, G2 Esports struggled to find a roster that would bring success until summer 2015. With over 10 roster changes, the team had one constant star player, mid laner Perks. Among the crowded field of top tier talent, the 17 year old carry went on to be one of the most statistically dominant mid laners across the entire region. In his first professional season, he earned a Rookie of the Split title, and Perks asserted his dominance in the mid lane throughout all of G2's games, crushing opponents in favorable matchups and extending his lead into the enemy jungle and side lanes. His impact is always felt and played a crucial role in G2's victories. Perks was able to play forward and aggressive because Trick was often in the shadows, enabling his team with exceptional vision and high pressure play that became synonymous with G2's style. This was especially true on signature champions like Nidalee and Graves, both enabling Trick to invade, contest and kill anyone standing in his way. When it comes to kills and damage per minute, Trick tops the tables, complementing his mid laners play patterns to a T. How can two hyper-aggressive players go unchecked and unpunished? Hybrid is a big part of the answer. G2 as a team rely on their impressive frontline, opting to frequently draft utility-focused tanks into all of their team comps. G2 can often find both peel and engage in their support, and Hybrid commands the role so well, he has the highest KDA of all players in Europe. It's no surprise that this oppressive, highly coordinated lineup earned G2 Esports a first place regular season finish in their inaugural split in the LCS. A first for any squad out of the European Challenger Series. With the table topping record, the league's fastest average win time, the highest number of kills, the largest early game gold leads and a bye to the semi-finals as the playoffs first seed, the 2016 Spring Split Championship may be G2 Esports to lose.